let's turn our task manager app into a multi-tenant application where users can be assigned to tasks. Let's add two extra fields to tasks, creator and owner. Now we have a choice. We can add several tables to manage users and roles. This will require configuring our own screens to manage users and integrating these tables into the security system of the application. Instead, why don't we take the easy way? Let's enable the built-in security system based on ASP.NET membership. Switch back to the generator, select the project name, press settings, and open the database connection page. Open the connection string settings. Under the membership section, press add. We will need to refresh the project schema in order to pick up the new changes to the database. Let's go ahead and add creator and owner as fields in the tasks model. Check the boxes next to the two new fields and save the data model. We will need to mark these two new fields as a username lookup. Open the project designer. Switch to the controllers tab, expand tasks, and expand fields. Double click on the creator field. Change the item style to username lookup. Make the same change to the owner field. Let's add a business rule to set up the creator as the current user whenever a new task is created. Right click on the business rules node and press new business rule. This SQL business rule will run before the command insert. The at business rules underscore username parameter will be automatically populated by the application framework to the current username. This script will set the current user as the creator. If the owner has not been specified, then the current user will be set as the owner as well. Let's go ahead and make some cosmetic changes to the presentation. Expand the views node. Let's modify grid one. Remove the fields that we've borrowed from the location table. Make the same changes to grid all tasks. Go ahead and regenerate the application. Now that the application has a security system, two controls will be displayed on the home page. The first contains the sitemap that we have seen previously. The second contains default instructions for signing in, as well as a login button. Let's sign in using the administrative account. Let's go ahead and set a theme for this user. Press the hamburger button in the top left corner and press settings. Let's change the theme. Let's create a new task. We can now set the owner to any user in the system. Notice that the creator field has been set to the current user. 
Let's log in as the user account. Press the user icon in the top right corner and press add account. Let's go ahead and create a task. The creator has been set to the user account. Our records are stamped with the identities of users. Ownership of tasks can be assigned to specific users as well. That alone does not make our application a true multi-tenant data management tool. Let's segregate tasks to ensure that users can only see tasks created by or assigned to them. We have two strategies. The advanced strategy involves using a premium feature called Access Control Rules to globally filter access to the tasks controller. Instead, we'll use filter expressions. Switch back to the project designer. Double click on grid one. Let's go ahead and extend this filter expression. This filter will ensure that the user can only see records assigned to or created by them. Let's also add the same filter to grid all tasks. Go ahead and generate the application. We are currently logged into the user account. Notice that we can only see two records, both of which have been assigned to us. Let's create another task and assign it to the admin account. Next. Let's go ahead and switch to the admin account. Notice that the task that the user has created is now visible to the admin account. Let's create a task that only the admin account can see. We did not assign the owner. The business rule that we created has ensured that the owner has been assigned to the current user, admin. Let's switch to the user account. Notice that the task that we created under the admin account is not visible to the user. You will not find the task under the all tasks view as well.